Go. What's today's day? Hey, good morning, Mark. Good morning. Today, and, uh, <laughs> today is September uh, 23rd, and yeah. it's Martin Stresser's birthday today. Perfect. And so we'll celebrate that tonight? Absolutely. Um, and where are we headed today? So uh, right now we're in Hami in China. Yeah. And we're heading to uh, Dunhuang. Dunhuang, yeah. Which means uh, we're uh, leaving uh, the hassle yeah, of the <laughs> province of the province of Jinjiang. Yeah. We're, uh, we're going to the province of Gansu. Yeah, good. And um, in Dunhuang we will stay uh, two nights, so tomorrow is a day off. Thank God. Dunhuang, the hotel, is located near the dunes because we're going into the Taklamakan Desert today. Yeah. And, uh, it and will Taklamakan be is the biggest desert in the world, yeah? No, it's the second biggest sand desert. Second biggest, well, there's distinctions. Well, yeah. <laughs> but it's quite big, so, yeah. so we had to pass it uh, the last three days. Yeah. Uh, and on the highways, and from now on, we mainly go on secondary roads, country roads, and more curves, more landscape, more nice. And how many kilometers or miles we have today? 400? Something? Today is 420 kilometers. 420, so 280 miles, give or take? Yeah, yeah. And uh, anything you want to say to your friends back in Germany or to the Idlewise team? All is good. All is good, Chaka bra. <laughs> All right, thank you, Mark. All right, good morning, Martin. <laughs> and uh, and uh, you feeling good this morning? Very good. Yeah. Uh, you can speak in Chinese. So, yeah. And where are we going today? Today we go to a famous city, Dunhuang, on the Silk Road. Uh, good. And um, you're not riding a motorcycle. Where are you riding? I'm riding in my red donkey. In the red donkey. And what is your job? What do my, you do? My, my job is tour guide the tour China. Guide. And I like this job. I like my people. And we will work uh, all the way we will do together. And uh, it's a fun. All right. And what time is it now? It's now is about uh, 8.30. And what happens yeah. at 8.30? It's the 30s. Clutch out. Clutch out at 8.30. Thank you, Martin. You're welcome. All right, it's 10.30. We are at a rest stop. Uh, calling it a rest stop is a liberal interpretation. That building there is uh, full of pits that have holes in the ground and you, uh, you know, you do your business through this hole, that's it. Anyway, uh, so behind me, that's all the bikes. We are about, I guess we're 70 miles into our journey of 280 miles today. And uh, we're running low on gas, few of the bikes. Mike had to put gas in his. Looks like 66 kilometers to the next gas station. And, um, and he had only a uh, range of 60. So he put some gas in and uh, we'll see what happens. Um, temperature today is uh, quite nice. Uh, in fact, the wind is a little bit, uh, a little bit tough on the face. Uh, a lot of thrashing and such. And so I put on some sunscreen. And you'll notice that's the new haircut. So uh, people have told me they don't even know who I am. So uh, at any rate, we are expected to stop and get gas in sometime like the next 45 minutes. And I'll give another report then. Take care, everybody. Okay, it is the 23rd of September, 1.30 p.m. and we are at a gas station. We are just outside the border of the province uh, where the political uh, dispute is. So we are, call it four or five hundred yards from the border and already we come to this gas station and the big yellow barriers that are typically up wasn't up. The barrier was pushed out of the way. We didn't have to show passports. Uh, the only peculiarity was that they made us push our bike um, from the entrance way over there over to here. So that was a minor inconvenience in the big scheme of things but we're pretty happy and we got gas and uh, things are going swimmingly well and it's much cooler with my new less hair 345 in the afternoon very rarely am I in a position to bestow such an honor but I dub the world's greatest melon delicious very juicy desperately needed 